spring is obviously the best opportunity for the young guys coming up to kind of make their mark and establish themselves. So there's a lot of competition in the spring typically at all the positions and that's what we really kind of emphasize is you know, making the most of your opportunity. And then spring's also a time to look at some things uh, schematically on both sides of the ball and try to get a start on things that you'll be doing in the fall. The main objective we wanted to accomplish in, uh, defensively was one of our theme going in here was find the inches. And we went back in the season, a lot of, you know, we missed a couple plays here and a couple plays here. So we wanted to find the inches within our scheme as a staff, with the players. John McMiniman has really brought a lot of nice wrinkles to what we're doing. You know, we have the foundation as far as what we've been doing in the past and our terminology and so forth. But I've worked with John in the past. He's very knowledgeable and, and he's brought some really interesting things and some good schemes for us offensively. And it's been fun to watch him integrate those into the things that we've successfully been doing to this point and he's been a great addition. I wanted to get to know the guys as good as I can. You know, energy level and the ability to have fun are really important to me. I thought the more we got to know uh, each other going through the spring, the more fun we have. You know, secondly is just execution, kind of seeing what you have, what kind of cards you were dealt. I think we have a great talent base on offense and a lot of guys that want to do well. It's fun to see them in action. They're going to really work their tails off. It's something that I put a lot of pride in trying to put them in a position to succeed. We're always trying to get better. All the, the defensive staff, we went and visited some other staffs and uh, talked to some other, other coaches, you know, at the FBS level, at the NFL. And just, we just tried to make our scheme and our practices better. And we did put in a few new wrinkles. We put a different thumbprint, you know, on the program that uh, hopefully adds to what we already have to make it successful. So we just did some things, you know, as personnel, moving some guys around, some procedural things that we think, you know, can give our offensive line a chance, you know, with some cadence things, the clapping. It's really efficient and then the kids took well to it. And so quarterbacks had a tough job in that they, they got a lot of new stuff thrown at them that we all like, and the more and more they ran it, uh, the better they did. The offense that uh, I inherited was extremely talented. They had a great year. They put up a ton of statistics. So you want to just add a couple things that tie into it and uh, hopefully build on it. Some of the young guys really stepped up. You know, we had uh, Delaney Taala. He's a defensive lineman, true freshman. A lot of the true freshmen, actually, have, have uh, really been impressive and some of the younger guys, Jalen Zachary, of course we knew what he could do and some of the freshman offensive linemen have really stepped it up. Blake Freeman really had a good spring and Marcus Zimmerman had a good spring and Nick Warren, uh, those guys up front have, have really been strong. And then Jackson Newman, one of our safeties, is he's another freshman that uh, really tested out well and had a good spring. So we got quite a few of those guys that uh, got some reps this spring and, and really did a great job. The whole group is, is really surprising because each individual is different and it's fun for me to step in and see how they interact. And really these game situations, you get to see, you know, somebody light up and, you know, uh, example, Eric Siebenshu is a really, you know, he's a quarterback and he's very, calm demeanor and um, before the last play when he threw a touchdown he said you know call this play again it'll work and it's good to see him say that so you see the fire you know Brook Bowles and, and Fugate are the same way they're a bunch of competitors a lot of guys stood out just my position group working with the linebackers Alex Lackey he kind of stood out this year just uh, his leadership and, and just kind of taking control of the defense a little bit and just making sure everybody was lined up he did a great job for us you know everybody kind of contributed this year and, and you know did what they're supposed to do but he was one of the guys Austin Miller freshman from day one from winter conditioning to now they just busted their tail. Well I like the energy that they brought to every practice. I mean we really didn't have a bad practice from the standpoint of them being mentally ready and really maximizing the, the opportunities that they have on the field and to get better that's really what it's about. That had to do very little coaching with regard to that and that's always a good sign when you got a self-motivated group and you know our leadership is some older guys that are kind of lead by example guys, not really rah-rah guys, but they've, they've really worked hard in the program and they're sort of that type of guy, you know, program guys. And really the, just the overall work ethic and their attention to detail was, was exciting for me.